My name is Malcolm and I'm a PSLE Science Specialist here at The Big Lab. Welcome to another episode of PSLE Science Made Simple. In this video, I'll be going through a past year examination question on the topic of magnets. I've also prepared this question for you to download for free by clicking a link in the description box below. So let's get started. Question 9. Beth arranged three bar magnets as shown below, and they tell us that the magnets here, they did not repel each other. In fact, if you look at the three magnets over here, we can see that they are all stuck together. Now think about this. When the magnets are all stuck together, are they repelling or attracting? They must be attracting each other. So I'm going to draw this out. We know that the magnets here, they must all be attracting. And then, the reason why they can even attract in the first place is because what poles of the magnets must have been facing each other? Is it the unlike poles or the like poles? For two magnets to attract each other, it must be the unlike poles that are facing each other. So, we can write this out. It's the unlike poles that are facing each other. And now they ask, which one of the following diagrams show us the correct poles for the three magnets? So let's take a look at option one. Now for option one, if you look at the three magnets, only which pole is labeled? Only the north pole. And do you remember, every magnet will always have how many poles? They have two poles, one north and one south. So if this is the north pole of the magnet, what do you think this pole is going to be? This must be the south pole. Similarly, if this is the north pole of the magnet, what do you think this pole is going to be? This pole is going to be the south pole. And I'm sure you can tell me, what about this pole over here? This pole is also going to be the south pole. But you look carefully. Remember, for the magnets to attract one another, what must be facing each other? You must have the unlike poles. So let's check for the first one. If you look at option one and you look at these two magnets, are the unlike poles facing each other? Yes, so this is possible. But what about for the next part? Are the unlike poles facing each other? No, in fact, if you look at this, what poles are facing each other here? It is the like poles. And remember, when the like poles are facing each other, what will happen to the two magnets? They will repel. And if they repel one another, can they be stuck together like this? No, when magnets repel one another, they are going to move towards or away from each other. They are going to move away from each other, which means is option one possible? No. So let's cross out option one. Next, can we label the poles for option two as well? So if the top part is the north, the next one must be south. And then this must be the north. And this must be the north. So once we have labeled all the poles, let's check. If you look over here, are the unlike poles facing each other? Yes, this is possible. What about over here? Same thing, unlike poles facing each other, number two is possible. But let's check number three and number four just to be safe. Now for number three, let's go and label the poles. So if we know that this is the south pole, the one at the bottom must be north, and then the next part is south, and the final pole is south. So let's go and check. Over here are the unlike poles facing each other. No, these are also the like poles. And remember, what happens when like poles are facing each other? The two magnets are going to repel, which means it's option three possible. No, so let's cross it out. And finally, let's label the poles for option four. So if this is the south pole, what must this pole be? That is going to be the north, and then north, and then the last part is south. Now, let's check the first set of poles. Now, if we look at these two, are the unlike poles facing each other? No. Once again, which poles are these? These are the like poles, which means is option 4 going to be possible? No. So, 4 is out. Therefore, the only possible answer has to be option Thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you found this video useful, do give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to check out more videos by us, do click on the links on the right hand side. 
Last but not least, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos. Thank you and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!